Hi everybody, <laughs> welcome to my channel, it's Tina from Tina's Talk Time and I'm coming on to do another sales haul. <laughs> it's not a large one, just a short one really. Uh, a few items I got online in the John Lewis sale and then another Marks and Spencers one. Um, so, the first thing is this jumper that I got. It's like a black background with pink um, lavender and white flowers on. Um, this is quite a nice weight. It's not too warm, but it's quite thick. Um, and I'm putting this on with the, you know, the skirt that I got in the Marks and Spencers sale. Uh, now this was £22 instead of £32. So it's a £10 saving. So I'm quite pleased with this. I think probably the back is, is just plain black. So the print is only on the front. Um, but I don't mind that. I quite like that. I like the sleeves. Can you see they're quite like a blue blouse on sleeve, like a full sleeve with a deep cuff, um, which I think give it a little bit more style. And I like the way the shoulders are as well. So I'm keeping this one. So I like this one. Let me know what you think. Right, now the second item is this red floral dress. It's a, the make is finery. It's a v-neck and a, a puff sleeve with like an elasticator. Um, midi lens, well practically ankle lens. Um, this had been £59.95 uh, or 99 and it, it was £23.60. Funny price, but that's what it was. Now, I don't think this is available in John Lewis anymore, but they do have it in the Marks and Spencer's sale. And also, you can go on the Finery, the Makes Finery website, and they have it on there for the same price. So, the only thing I wasn't too keen on is got a side zip, which I'm not fond of a side zip. But apart from that, it's quite a nice dress. Well, I probably won't keep it because I've got quite a lot of dresses. Um, but I do like it. I don't dislike it. Funny, somebody asked me what I did with all the clothes. And I said, well, I don't keep them all. I do, do send a lot back, you know. Um, or the ones that have been gifted, I often just donate those, it, you know, if it's not something that I would wear normally. Because there's only so much cruise wear you can wear when you don't go on a cruise, isn't there? Anyway, um, so this one's £23.50. Um, I think it's quite good to John Lewis because you can have it delivered. They've got like local delivery places that you, you can pick them up from, you know, supermarkets and that. So that's quite good. Right, on to the next one. Right, this is another finery dress. It's a lovely poppy print. I love the blue. Um, this is £19.60. It had been £49.99. It's got um, a fluted sleeve. I'm not too sure how I would go on with the sleeves. Um, I don't like, and it's got a side zip again, which I'm not fond of. Anyway, I'll go and try it on and you can see what it looks like. Oh, I forgot to say, I got these dresses in an 18. Um, this is the next one, the one that I told you was £19.60. Um, it's sort of, sort of mid-calf length. Um, I do love the colours of it. I'm not too keen on these sleeves. I don't know. They might not get in the way as much with them being um, sort of three quarter. It's like a bell sleeve or something at the end. I don't know what you'd call it. But I do like the print of it. It's really pretty print. You know, so let me know what you think anyway. And then, I just wanted to show you this. This was bought in the Marks and Spencer's sale. It, uh, not the John Lewis, the Marks and Spencer's. It's a cardigan. And this was £9. I'll just try it on. Uh, instead of £29.50. Be interesting to see how these sleeves cope with a cardigan. Because I did wonder. So I thought that was quite a nice cardigan for £9. I have got quite a few cardigans, really. I don't really need it, but for five uh, for nine pound, it's such a bargain. Probably need them this winter with the uh, heating. Right, I've got a bit of a new um, look for you today. I'm doing a bit of the busy bee Marie on the <laughs> sitting on the bed, but that's not the reason why. Um, I'm, what I'm doing is I'm continuing the sale haul because I filmed. 
the previous footage about a week ago um, and I had some more items on order which have arrived so I thought I'd show you those there's um, one from Marks and Spencer's um, one from John Lewis that hadn't arrived and then I've got some from Wallace um all i think they're all sale items yeah they're all sale items i have got a few marks and spencers ones on the way um which i think are new season uh, but i'll show you those at um, a later date now i've come in here because it's the best light to be truthful um for filming because we've had such dreary weather in the uk i don't know what it's like i mean i did notice that california's had massive floods um, so any of your overseas viewers, I'm sorry if you've had bad weather too. We've just had such dull, dreary um, weather, sort of really dark and dismal. You don't want to go out, it's been that bad. And flooding as well, you know. But the funny thing is, I thought, oh, I'll do it. This is my daughter's bedroom that she had when she lived at home, which is desperately in need of decorating. Um, when I can get around to clearing it out. I mean, I don't know what it is about when your adult children leave home. They leave loads of stuff behind. They haven't got room for it, but you have. <laughs> I'm going to get in trouble for saying that, but you know, it's true, isn't it? I bet you're all the same. So anyway, um, I've just got a few things to show you. Um, oh, just let me have a cup of a drink of my tea. I'm so thirsty today. Actually, it's coffee. I'm so thirsty today. Anyway, um, first of all, uh, I'll try some of the things on after, but I'll just show you um, a couple of the things first. Right, I have had a bit of a problem because this paperless um, packaging drives me mad because you can never see unless you can remember how much you've paid for something, which I'm going to have to make a note of it. Um, there's no prices anywhere. Even when I've gone into my orders um, on the Wallace website, um and the john lewis i think um it doesn't tell you how much they were it's probably because they keep reducing them anyway um i'll just show you first of all um this is from marks and spencers and it's a sleep bra now oh do you know, it's a sleep bra um when you get older and you've got such big boobs it is more comfortable to sleep in a bra now these have been 16 pound and I bought two actually, but I've been wearing one. I bought a navy one and a grey one, and they were reduced to six pounds. And I do have to say, they're lovely and soft and comfortable. Um, they are really, really nice. So I thought they were a good buy. I don't know if they've still got them. So that's uh, the other item I got from Marks and Spencers. Now I'll move on to the item that I got from John Lewis that hadn't arrived when I did my last order. Um, it's just a pair of plain black trousers, which um, I wanted a good pair of black trousers, but you don't you? Um, now these uh, were from John Lewis and the original price was £89. What make? Oh, the mint velvet, uh, but they've reduced them to 45 which I thought, you know, it's a lovely fabric. It's got a very slight sheen on. Do you know, since I started filming, <laughs> since I came up here and set up filming, the sun's come out. I've had to draw the curtains because it's so, um, so bright now. You wouldn't believe it, would you? <laughs> anyway, so I, I, I'm pleased with those um, because it's always nice to have a really good pair of black trousers. You wear them so much. Not so pleased about the next ones. Now, these were from Wallace. And I think they were about £50 originally, and they were reduced to 20 Now, they're velvet, and I thought I could put them away for next Christmas, but I thought they were a wine velvet, um, and they're not the... Well, I don't like this shade of red. I will try them on for you, but I'm definitely not keeping them. They have got pockets on, and I thought for £20, it was they were OK, but I really don't like them, so... Um, I won't be keeping those. You see, you sort of have to get the videos done quick now because sale items, you've often only got 14 days to return them. Then the next thing I got from Wallace um, is a similar dress to what Busy B. Marie got in the sale. I told her I got one on order, but it's obviously not as good as hers. This was uh, just a Wallace one. And it had been, it, oh, they don't have the price on, but I know it had been £80 and it was reduced to 45 
So I'll try that on. I just thought I could put it away for next Christmas. You know, but it's very similar to that Ralph Lauren one, which looked fabulous on Busy Bee Marie. I don't know if you've watched her channel, but it was lovely. This jumper. It, this is from Wallace as well. And I do like this. And um, this was 23 50 from £59. It's quite a long jumper. I do like a long jumper. Um, so... And then another one I got, but this looks very long and big, was this one. And this, I think this was 27.50 from 55. They got quite a good sale on Wallace, so it's worth having a look. Does feel very heavy. Note to self, don't ever go to the doctors and get weighed with this on. <laughs> and then um, the what else have I got? Oh, the final item I've got is another one from Marks and Spencers that I forgot to show you, uh, which is New Season, and I think it was twenty nine fifty or twenty five pound. I will check. I will be able to check that. Um, I actually thought it was black, but I think it's navy. It's difficult to tell, really. It's M and S collection, size eighteen. Right, as I throw it on the floor. So what I'm going to do now is I'll go and try some of them on. Oh, look at that bright sun. It's a nightmare, isn't it? I'll have to perhaps turn the camera the other way around. Right, I'll just try them on. I'll be back in a minute. Oh, do you know, just a whole spiel about this blouse. I never put the camera on. I've switched it round so it looks a bit, not got the bright sunlight. Um, so, um, I, I do like this blouse. It's um, from Marks and Spencer's, 29.50. And it's a dark navy. I think it'd look really nice with white trousers, you know, in the spring. Um, it's got a lovely elasticated cuff. Um, covers up the bingo wings because it's a nice long sleeve, but they're not tight. You know, sometimes they're too tight for you around the top when you're bigger. Um, and it's longer at the back. I don't know you can see. It's like a shirt style where it's longer at the back. I don't know you can see. Can you see if I walk over here? And also, uh, the thing I like about it was it's got a fastener at the back, but I could easily get it on and off without undoing the fastener. Because sometimes it's really hard to do the fastener. Now, while I've got this on, I'll try those horrendous red trousers on. <laughs> Just bear with me. Right, so these are the red trousers. I don't know if you can see them properly. Now, I don't like the colour of them. They're a bit too bright red. If they'd have been a wine colour, I would have liked them. Um, you know, I think I'd already got more wear out of them. But uh, no, I'm sending these back. I'm not keen on these. But if you like them for £20, they've got pockets in, which is nice. The pockets don't bulge. Um, it's a side zip. I'm never keen on side zips, but I could just pull them on so it wasn't too bad. So they were £20 from Wallace, so... Oh, and by the way, you remember that jumper uh, from Marks and Spencer I was telling you about where they never sent it? Well, I did get a refund on it. Um, I had to ring them again, which was really annoying, because you know you're in queues for ages, aren't you? Um, but anyway, I did get through to them, and they have, um, because all it said on the website was a waiting return. Well, I hadn't a jumper to return because they didn't send it. So um, anyway, they have refunded me the £50. So I'm pleased about that. I think I'd have rather had the jumper. But anyway, anyway, on to the next thing. Now, the next thing I'll try on. Um, oh, should I stick with Wallace? I'll, st I'll stick with the Wallace item. Oh, no, I'll tell you what. I'll try these black trousers on. Um, from John Lewis, the mint velvet trousers. Um, I do really like these. As I say, they were £45, which is quite expensive, but they are a good trouser. As I say, they've been um, £89. I mean, who'd pay £89 for a pair of black trousers? But it's all down to how, you know, relative to how much um, money you've got and what you can afford, isn't it, really? Right, I'll just pop along and put these on. Won't be a moment. Right, so these are the black trousers. Um, 
I'll see if I can tilt you down. <laughs> Keep doing this, don't I? Okay, I do like these trousers. As I say, they're £45. They've got pockets on. Um, they do feel really, really good. Nice fastening here. Um, front fastening. A zip and then two poppers. Um, I have put a few pounds on over Christmas, so hopefully they'll fit me even better. Although, you know, they're not a bad fit. I do like them and I like the length. The length is perfect for me. Because nowadays, don't you find, don't you find that you get a regular or a short and they're still really, really long. Um, I think, well, it's like when you order from abroad, they think that women are giants nowadays. <laughs> Unless we're shrinking as we get older, I don't know. Right, um, on to the next item. So whilst I've got these trousers on, I'll try the Wallace jumpers on. Right, this is definitely a no from me. It's just far too big. I know it's probably the style, but I don't like them like that. Um, and this is 27.50. 27.50 instead of 55. And it's um, a size 18. It splits at the side. I definitely will not be keeping this. It's far too big. I know it's a style, but it's not me. It's a shame, really, because I do quite like the print on it. And it feels nice on, you know, if it's the sort of thing you like. If you like, you know, some people like things really big. Um, or if you, you know, it would fit somebody much larger. And I don't know that you can see. Can you see how baggy it is at the back? It's a split up the side. Do you know, I keep thinking there's something on it there. It's in the design. Can you see that? I keep thinking there's a mark on it. Looks a bit strange. Doesn't it? Can you see what I mean? Anyway, this is going back. Um, but you might like it, you know. It's certainly warm. Well, it would be, wouldn't it? <laughs> it's mad too big. Right. This is the final jumper and I do like it. I have had one a similar style before, but it was just in plain black. Um, and that one was from Wallace when they used to be in Debenhams. You know, when we had a Debenhams. <laughs> I know we've got an online Debenhams now. Uh, right, so I'll just show it you. Oh, falling over, I'm not used to wearing high heels. It's like asymmetric at the front, can you see? Wish it was a little bit longer at the back. Can you see? But I do quite like it. It does feel very warm. Um, and this was £23.50. Uh, this would be, I think this had been 59 But for some reason, it was £23.50. It's got this detail down the front, which I think if you're larger, it's quite flattering that, you know. It feels a bit snug. That, well, I'm just thinking it looks snug with my having uh, lines going round. Um... But I do like it, and I will keep this one. For £23.50, I think it's a good buy. The quality is really nice. I mean, I had a plain black one in this design, oh, a few years ago, and I had so much wear out of it. So I am pleased with this. I will be keeping this. So it's a thumbs up from me. Right, now, on to the final outfit, which is the dress. I've no idea whether it fits... I can't be able to put any shape. I'd, I'd have no idea. I'm going to try the dress now. I've no idea whether it fits me. And I can't be bothered to put any shape wear on. So we'll see. But these trousers and this um, top I'm pleased with. Right, so this dress is a no. Um, it, it's, it's too tight for me, really. Um, I have put weight on over Christmas. You know, I've probably put about half a stone on, so I do need to lose that. But, but even then, I think this dress was £40 from 80 or 85 It is nice. It's quite warm. Um, I don't know if you saw Busy Bee Marie had one on, um, on her channel, um, a Ralph Lauren one in this colour. She looks stunning in it. Um, but I'd already ordered this, so I wouldn't have ordered it because I didn't want uh, to order something similar. But um, now it's going back. It's too tight round here for me. I 
I mean, I haven't got any straight wear on, but I don't think uh, I don't think I get the wear out of it. You know, what I would have done was put it away for next Christmas. But and I don't like showing the fronts of my legs because I've got some broken veins on them. So, so this is going back as well. So from Wallace, I'm just keeping one jumper, I think. <laughs> so I'm keeping the Marks and Spencer's blouse and the black trousers from, um, where were they from? Oh, from John Lewis. Yeah. I'm not trying the bra on for you. <laughs> I can assure you it fits nicely. <laughs> anyway, um, I'll just turn around. As we're trying all these clothes on, um, your hair and everything gets such a a mess doesn't it <laughs> it needs cutting really but i can't my the my hairdressers away till um february um and i can't get an appointment till mid-february so but anyway i hope he's enjoyed he's gone on uh, a lovely exotic holiday somewhere so i'm hoping um he enjoys himself <laughs> Anyway, um, that's about it from me. If you've enjoyed this video, it'd be really helpful for me if you would subscribe or tick the like button or comment. Um, it really makes a difference to how uh, YouTube um, promote your video. So it would be really helpful. Another thing I wanted to mention as well, um, if you like clothing hauls, um, if you don't follow Helen Mary Jo, I would follow her. She does some brilliant um, clothing hauls and she's just done a monsoon haul, um, which was really, really, I mean, she's some beautiful clothes, but she's going on a cruise. So they're more uh, suitable for going on a cruise. So um, I'll put details of her channel and Busy Bee Marie and Maria Cock Crocker, who, who did the other collab with us um, in my uh, description box, which is under more, un under the photo you'll see more, there'll be a description of the video and then it'll say more. And if you click on that, that's the description box. And so there's all sorts of details in there. Um, so I'll put the details in there and um, I would love to put links to these uh, clothes, but it's so difficult, you can't find the price of them. So it's, I struggle to find the price. Um, but if there's anything that you're particularly interested in, just let me know and I'll see what I can do, see if I can sort it out. Um, so as I was saying, I'd love you to subscribe if you've enjoyed the video um, and I'm ho hoping to do I think I've got another clothing haul on the way. Um, I've got another exciting collab in February um, for Valentine's Day. Not that I've got a Valentine, but you know what I mean. <laughs> we'll have to make a Galentine's Day, won't we? That's all the rage, isn't it? All the girls getting together for a Galentine's Day. <laughs> Um, so anyway, I'm going to go now. So bye for now um, and I'll see you at my next video, hopefully. Bye bye.